Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. This is Peter Drury and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Well, off we go then. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Well, I'm going to go for the little wriggler, that is Raheem Sterling. Uh, his small frame and, and pace gives him a real advantage over bigger, slower defenders. And his turning sharpness is another very tricky part of his game, and he's a handful. Not to disagree with that, it is the sort of situation he thrives in. That's played to a promising move. He's made sure that that won't get through. Cuts it out. De Bruyne. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Picked him out. Cavani. He's away. Shoots. Goal! Manchester United! Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Can he find a finish now? Lofted into the middle. Ball's loose, who's getting there? And it's Mares. So, they got the only goal to make it 1-0. Sterling. Looks like a good ball through. Now it's Cavani, looking to force his way through. Oh, great save, real class. Keeper has shown great concentration there. I think his anticipation pretty much did the trick for him. Get that clear. A chance! It's a carbon copy of their previous miss. Well, when you see chance after chance go astray like that, it's only natural to think that they may end up with a little regret here. Sterling boots it upfield. Spoon forward. Oh, good interception. Plays it out to the wing. Aim forward. Cavani passes it through. Cavani needed to come up with a better ball. Yeah, and the vision to get him through was all good, but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right. But importantly, he's holding his line until the very last moment, and that will pay off. How about it? Goal! And with that goal comes comfort. <laughs> well, you've got to say, the odds on him missing from there were very slim. It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. <laughs> Man.
Manchester United take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Shaw tries to get it forward quickly. Tokpa steaming forward. It's the through ball. Rashford. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Big chance! A decent effort as the first half draws to a close. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Manchester United now have a decision to make. Do they look to add to their two goals or will they be confident of defending them? They just need to be clear about their second half intentions. That's important. Manchester United sitting pretty here at half time. 2 0 up. Belts one. And back to base. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. Looks to slip it through. It's Rashford. Rashford unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Fernandinho tries a long pass towards the front. And the ball is out of play. There's going to be a change here. There's a man waiting to come on. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Forward it goes. A chance! He's gone for it! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. Yeah, and that was all about the through ball. Great control, and the weight was perfect. looking for can he find a finish now keeper beats it away and the assistant referee rightly gives him offside touch and go aren't they supposed to get the benefit well positioned to make that interception What looks like he's in need of protection here. Yeah, and they They are rampant! And surely that settles it! Cavani versus the keeper, and only one winner. Yeah, he always had the measure of the keeper, and there was very little doubt as to how this was going to end up. Manchester United take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Out to the left it goes. Sure. Goes long. 
Longman forward. Out wide to the right. Thrust towards the front line. It's a long forward pass. Rashford with the ball through. Cavani. Gets it upfield. Rashford, and the finish! He scored! Over the hills and far away! No catching them now! Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. Manchester United totally rampant here. Fernandinho floats one over. There will be four extra minutes. And it's Mares. Pogba pumps it upfield. Tries a through ball. Cavani. Turns and goes back. In it goes! This is as ruthless as it gets. Well, I think we've gone past humiliation now. This could be doing some real psychological damage. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Well, the stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing. And that will be the final act. Manchester United were irresistible here. Dominant, utterly ruthless. Only ever one result, a comfortable win. Well, how will we look back on that? Manchester United made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do.